and on the environment, 1,200 scientists and professionals have signed a declaration stating that there's no climate emergency. NTD's Jason Perry spoke with one of them. Some scientists continue to warn of a climate emergency, such as in this video posted by The Economist. In your day-to-day -day life, it may not seem significant, but three degrees of global warming would be catastrophic. <laughs> Environmentalist Bill McKibben said this. And we're not going to stop global warming. That, unfortunately, is off the menu at this point. But we can, we think, still stop it short of the place where it cuts civilizations off at the knees. President Biden also addressed the issue recently. Climate change is literally an existential threat to our nation and to the world. But others say the world is not ending. Um, contrary to what they believe. Sterling Burnett is the director of the Arthur B. Robinson Center on Climate and Environmental Policy. He's one of 1,200 scientists and professionals who signed a World Climate Declaration, stating there is no climate emergency. He spoke about the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, or IPCC, which is under the United Nations. He said they produce reports, and much of the body of their research is good. Before they produce them, though, they, they produce a summary. For, it's called a summary for policymakers. And the policymakers, this is where the politicians get, get, get in the mud there and start mucking it up. They get in there and they rewrite it. They basically say, no, we're going to de-emphasize that because it's not alarming. He went on to say that one can agree with the IPCC research, but not agree with the summary for policymakers. To him, the data doesn't show a climate catastrophe. We reached out to the IPCC for comment, but we didn't hear back before airtime. You can view the declaration at clintel.org. Jason Perry, NTD News.